I told you, just get arrested and meet Reese. me at the... Reese, are you there? Uh, Vaughn? Vaughn? Oh, Vasquez? Talk or walk, ladies. I don't have time for both. You made me and my accounting boys look like idiots with that 10 million you stole. It's gonna take years to do all the paperwork. Better. Up to it. <clears throat> Sorry, just ate a burrito. Never mess with accountants, Vasquez. You can always count on us outnumbering you. Smoke them! a mockery of the Hyperion finger gun tradition. Seriously? That's your problem with this? Wait. You're not Vasquez. Smoke him for real! <laughs> no! Shush! Shush! Got him now. Get it! Oh, bring it on! Oh, 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 Here's some more for ya! <laughs> Hope you're not allergic to lead! a mockery of the Hyperion finger gun tradition. Seriously? That's your problem with this? Wait. You're not Vasquez. Smoke him for real! This is it! We've got him surrounded! <laughs> Screw this thing. Well, look, you 
Even if it was a treasure map, it's not gonna do you much good down here. <clears throat> hey! What's going on here with, with you all? How's it going? Oh, hi, Reese! Things are going great! Did you just say Reese? Nothing! I could have swore you said Reese. Isn't that the name of the dead guy they picked up on Pandora? I'm Vasquez. Not Reese. Not a stupid robot, am I right? Yeah, based on what I saw upstairs, she's not the brightest tool in the shed. That doesn't make sense. Quiet! So what is it that I can help you with, Mr. Vasquez? Because if it's related to the incident upstairs, this is all under control. Just another case of vandalism on the Handsome Jack tour. How about you go take a break before I break my foot up in your ass? Leaving now, sir. Get out! Nice job. Hey, Gordas, just so you know, I, I didn't mean that. I was just acting. I know. You were acting me. It's okay. Why is my heart breaking right now? So... What is this plan, exactly? I found out about a trap door that leads to Jack's office. We just gotta figure out a way up. So I'm guessing the plan doesn't involve you getting mulched by a death machine? No, that's... that's a problem. How can we help? By figuring out a way to shut that thing off so I can get up there. Then I pull you up on the comm so you can identify the piece. Sounds like a plan. Wait! We gotta go up that scary dark hole? I think Reese is the only one scrawny enough to fit. Phew! Whew! Glad I got these meaty ham hocks. Hey, Gordis, you, uh, you wanna go first? Huh? Yeah? No, thank you! Well, aren't robots supposed to obey orders or something? Seems like a fun place, huh? No wonder you're single. I was joking. That's what I meant. Ooh, that death trap sure looks deadly with you know its deadliness and all. Just think of it like a big blender. Everyone loves smoothies. Yum! People flavor. Mm, not this kind. Now, so Fiona, I need you to hold this while Gordas boosts me up. Don't worry about hurting me, just climb on up. Well, I guess it's tough to hurt someone made of metal. Oh no, this is excruciatingly painful. But hey, I'm a team player. Reese wouldn't let us down. Oh, you haven't been around him as long as I have. You know, Fiona, sometimes you just gotta trust people. That hasn't worked out for me so far. Well, maybe this time is different. Alright, Gordis, just give me a little boost up there. No problem! Hurry up, Reese! Just because it's called a death trap doesn't mean you're gonna die, silly! Yeah, what she said. Although, I do see lots of blood. And death. Okay! <laughs> Better than I could have expected. Thanks. No problem! Try not to die. Reese, you alright? Nope. Good thing I got that puking out of my system. Maybe we should step away. Reese, you can do it! Climbing with your cyber arm should be easy! Easy, right? <laughs> Stupid, nice robot. You heard her! Climb! Climb!
You've got some impeccable timing. Hey, I don't know when you gave them the slip, but Finch and Kroger are out there looking for you, and things are gonna get messy if you start messing with us. You don't want to go rogue and throw Vaughn's life away, do you? Don't forget what's on the line here. You get us what we want, what we agreed to, and no one has to get hurt. Dude, I am in the middle of something. I'm gonna have to call you back. What? Listen to me, you... God, so dramatic about everything. Check you out, you made it! In the end, we make a pretty good team, huh? I mean, we had our differences, but we got here. My office. Well, uh, our office now. Gotta say, Jack, I, I couldn't have made it here without you. Hey, same to you, man. I used to dream about being here. Anyway, where's the Gordis Beacon? Well, it's gotta be over there somewhere. It's where all the corporate warfare fallout is. Ton of Atlas crap. Soak it in, kid. Enjoy yourself. Yeah, there's really no rush here. Just take it easy. Soak in the sights. Who's this? Oh, uh, yeah, that's my angel. Don't usually like people knowing about her, but <laughs> you and me are pretty tight. Once we're done with all this vault stuff, I'd like to check up on her. That's cool. What is this? Ah, uh, it's a piece from an early immortality suit prototype, but it, uh, killed the subject. Which is great, but just not what we're going for. Hey, there's my man. What's on your mind? So, what's the point of this office? I mean, from what I read, you spent most of your time running around Elpis or Pandora. Yeah, but it's always nice to have somewhere we can just... Kick back. Put up your feet. Fend some subordinates out in airlock. You know, it's like I always say. Home is where your airlock and collection of valuables is. You build this office yourself? <laughs> Did I build it? With... No. No, 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 no. Jack doesn't do manual labor. That desk do anything cool? <laughs> yeah, you'll see. I know, not in a, in a threatening, I'm gonna kill you way, but more like a, I'm gonna show you in a bit and it'll be awesome. Got it away. I think I'm just gonna take a look around. That's yeah, a spirit. Elpis. Where the guns are cold, the women are warm, and butt slams are your primary <laughs> method of communication. Gotta love it. A scarred, once upon a time sane moon. Yeah, a lot of people said similar things about me. Except, uh, for the scarred moon thing. That'd be weird. Welcome to my trophy case. Huh? Got a couple of killer relics. A few artifacts. Oh, there's a stock certificate signifying that I own Atlas. That's pretty frickin' cool. Nothing feels better than crushing a company's value to the point where you can buy all their shares with pocket change. It's delish. Gordis, you there? Hey! Uh, hi. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna show you the pieces now. You let me know which one it is. Alright? Okie dokie! Let's do this! Hey, <laughs> I know this is your office, but, uh... Negative. Definitely no. 
Oh, this? This shotgun. It's legend freaking dairy. <laughs> Hyperion named it the conference call, because you're going to want to call everyone to tell them how awesome it is. <laughs> then you kill them. Cowgirl! Yeah, I don't, uh, have a cowboy hat. Uh, but that was my girlfriend's hat. Well, her first one before she became a sexy badass sheriff type chick. <laughs> he suited her. So this means... you own Atlas? Yep, that's right. I own the whole shebang. This way I've got the option of building them back up to destroy all over again whenever I want. Great. I'll be down there in a minute. Okay. See you soon. Not much to look at. Okay. Here we go. The big seat is all yours. You trigger the trap door from there. With that Gordis thing, we should be able to still open the vault, right? I mean, there's no reason to rush it. So this is where it all happened. If by it all you mean the sex my girlfriend and I had, then yes. Ew. Feels good. That'd be the contact activated dopamine injectors. You look like somebody who could kill a bunch of people with a phone call and a little bit of bass in your voice. So tell me how to trigger the trap door. It's behind your pinky. This could be our last chance to chat, you and I. For years, I ruled Hyperion from this room. And now you're here, where it all started. How's it feel, kiddo? There's something to be said for a cushy chair with a bunch of big important buttons that can raise hellfire on people. It's good to be the king. I knew there was a reason we got along so well, kid. You get it. But say, we shared the power I had when I sat in this room. What would you do with it? What the hell is taking him so long? Reese, the machine is off. Did you get the beacon? We're ready for you. All good. Just getting into position. Oh! Someone is here! Hey! Oh, it's you! How are you doing? Who is it you're talking to? They told me to stay quiet. Oops! <gasps> We could wield Hyperion's might together. How would you rule? Hypothetical, of course. But still, you gotta know what you want if you're gonna make it, kid. Like I told you after we escaped Old Haven. Remember? I'd get payback. Valerie and Yvette for starters. You know, I like that. We could kill them all together, 
then you could rescue Bond. But imagine, Reese, if it wasn't hypothetical. You ever wonder why Nakayama created me? This whole AI thing? I was supposed to find a worthy successor to the Hyperion throne. And that successor, Reese, is you. If you join me, we can rule together. What do you say, kid? This is the only room with the override port, so if you don't jack in now, you'll never get another shot. Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Let's do it. Yes! You! You are my favorite dude! So what's next? There it is. That's the executive override port. Jack in, and this will all be yours. Jack in. You get it? Big moment for us, kiddo. Been a long time coming. A lot of people had to die. That's it. <laughs> Here it comes. Reese, the machine is off. Did you get the beacon? We're ready for you. All good. Just getting into position. Oh, she's gonna be so surprised when she sees the two of us running high period. And she doesn't even know I exist. That's... Oh, God, it's... it's priceless. So... is that it? Are we done? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, it feels good to get out of there. Road trip's over, Reese. We made it. So... What happens now? Oh, you? You're getting a huge promotion, pal. And since I'm in the system now, allow me to do the honors. Hey, friends. Remember me? It's your old pal, Jack. Well, pencils down, amigos. I've got someone to introduce you to. There's a new president in town. That's right, baby. Get those hands a clapping. Because I want to give a very special Hyperion welcome to the chief of executives, totally president material, all the way from janitorial. This can't be happening. Reese! Wait, so this is actually mine. This, this is mine to control. Take it in, Reese. Hyperion, Pandora, Elpis. Oh, they are just the start. We'll rule this entire freaking universe. You and me, kiddo. President Reese and handsome, goddamn Jack. 